Gemini's, my beautiful Gemini's, I love you so. Ooh, that a little bit of Danny Boy in it. Danny Boy, the pipes, the pipes are calling. Ooh, that's a sad song. Gemini, Gemini. Well, that's an old song, y'all. I'm going to say your grandparents are watching over you, Gemini's. That's sweet. That's sweet. That's sweet, Gemini's. Ooh, you beautiful bitches. How's the twins doing today? How's the twins doing today? You say, we doing fine, Daddy. We doing fine. We doing fine. Y'all behaving? Y'all behaving, my gems? You best be behaving. Mm -hmm. Ooh, Jims, I'm, I'm getting all musical with you all. I like that. I like that. Ooh, God protects me and God fights my battles. No weapon formed in spirit or physical against me shall prosper. I'm highly favored and protected from all evil. As is my beautiful Gemini Collective. You all had one that wanted to pop out here. Polish your mirror for perfect clarity. Okay, now I did a reading earlier today that said y'all bitch asses need to get your houses in order, right? Maybe y'all need to go through and clean your mirrors because I know my Geminis have lots of mirrors in your house, don't ya? So, yeah, of course, Daddy, we got to make sure we look good, right? You got to fluff the hair. Have at least two uh, full lengths so you can check your outfit out and see how it makes your ass look, right? Mm-hmm. Polish your mirror for perfect clarity. Now with the... Ooh, I'm getting like a turtle reference, guys. I, turtles is like good luck, isn't it? We got the moon showing up there. Turtles, good luck, moon. Geminis, I think for you all, this is... This moon's going to bring in some more good luck. Ah, Geminis. We're going to put this for like two weeks into May, guys. Okay, 21. 21 should factor, uh, could factor into something. Maybe some of my gems are turning 21. They go go drinking legally. Lord knows you've been a fish up till now. You can just go into a bar, right? Mm -hmm. I know who you are. I know who you are. Turtles. Some of them may like turtles. I'm thinking like a turtle necklace. You got some deception around you? Gemini's, because I'm noticing that fog up in the top of that. Uh, someone's trying to confuse you, okay, with the moon there and the fog. Uh, there could be a level of deception or confusion around you. So keep that in mind. As you go about your day, maybe that's why they're saying polish your fucking mirror, bitch. You think you look good, but you know, your, your mirror's fucking dirty, okay? Your mirror's dirty. Polish that shit up to get some clarity. Some of y'all may need to uh, self-reflect to figure out. Maybe you're the one creating your own mental confusion, Geminis. It's possible you're overthinking. You're twins in disagreement. Y'all are missing something, okay? Really drawn to like the turtle and the spiral. What's the spiral mean? I'm going to think like loop, uh, hoop earrings, but the spiral... But there's like two opposites. That's, yeah, that's your twins, right? Your spiral. You're thinking about something. That's it. You're thinking about something, Gemini's. And you need to you need to just take a minute, clean your fucking mirror, look at what you're looking at. Actually take the time to look at what you're looking at with no obstructions in the way. Because there is definitely some confusion and some emotion going on here. Uh, I'm not wanting to say deception so much as just confusion. Maybe you're 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 spiraling. You got something in your head, and you're spiraling around it so much that you're abs you're just fucking yourself up because you're you're just overthinking it. So clean the mirror. Look into yourself. You're creating this confusion yourself. You're creating this smoke screen. You're creating this. Okay, gems. The two fucking twins. Twenty one goes down to three. The father, son, and the Holy Ghost. Pray, pray on it for fuck's sake, Gemini's. Pray on it. Say, Jesus, what the hell? Help the twins out, Jesus. Help the twins out. Oh, I have to look because I've seen it. Empress in reverse in the Knight of Pentacles. 
uh, y'all, Capricorn had the, the, the Knight of Pentacles wanting to show up. Y'all, someone could be leaving a baby mama. I'm really getting baby mama with this, okay? Uh, baby mama or wifey, but I think there's a child involved in this. Someone is, uh, someone is going to quit giving to baby mama and wanting to make an offer to somebody else. Uh, I'm not really seeing marriage. This could just be someone you were fucking, you know, you're not married, you're not really, mm. or this person isn't married, depending upon whose perspective you're looking at it. But the Empress in reverse there, what? okay, this is a one night stand, right? Oh, Gemini's, someone get knocked up by a one night stand, it's a fuck boy, fuck girl energy, right? They are no longer in the picture. They're no longer in the picture, right? They've moved on. They're they're taking their offer somewhere else. Hmm. Gems. Ooh, y'all, I hope that ain't your energy. Now, if it ain't your energy, Jim, this could be someone who's wanting to come and make you an offer. So, you know, pay attention to see, see how many little babies they got out there, okay? Male or female, guys, it don't matter. You know, if the bitch got five kids at home, each with a different daddy, you might want to think about it for you fuck it, right? Put a rubber on that bitch. Um, women? How many kids does he have and how many baby mamas does he have? Maybe this person just wants to come in and offer... One, one, you know, one, once the goods have been spoiled, so to speak, and they don't want to take responsibility for what they do, they want to take their money and their ass somewhere else. So, Jims, uh, be wary of this energy. Because some of y'all, if you don't, you're going to have some fucking regrets. Okay? You're going to have some regrets. Sweet Jesus, Geminis, what the fuck are y'all getting yourself into? I'm, I'm going to put a fucking PSA in front of all my damn videos. Tell you motherfuckers to wear damn rubber. Use your birth control. Oh, Gemini's, I've just seen something very, very, very fucking interesting. I had a bastard card from Capricorn's reading stuck in this deck. I don't know if y'all can notice that on the side or not. Very, what, what, what bastard card? Did I not just say someone's gonna leave baby mama a bastard child? Oh my god. And I don't mean that in a bad way, guys. I mean it in like the, the old-fashioned sense of the fucking word, right? A fatherless child. The star in reverse. Uh-oh. Ooh. If any of you gems have Capricorn in your fucking chart, check this out, because the star in the upright was all about Capricorn's reading, okay? Okay, Jeez, Spirit, what the fuck was that? What? Okay, 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 okay. They're saying clarify this shit. Y'all remember, what happens during the reading happens for a fucking reason, Gemini's, so we going with it. Spirit, what the fuck you got going on for Jims? Ain't no motherfucker gonna be pissing on my Gemini's parade. Do we cut this deck? Come on, Spirit. Wake this deck up. Tell me what's up. Tell me what's up. Jims will probably pull that deck for you. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. The Knight of Pentacles in reverse, guys. Um... Oh, sweet Jesus. Um, okay. Okay. You remember the first part we were talking about? Someone leaving baby mama. The Empress in reverse. And now we got the star in reverse, guys. With the Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Um, there is a stork depicted on this star card. Do you see it there? And this is in reverse. So, uh, that's all I'm going to say on this. That's all I'm going to say on this, okay? Spirit, why the fucking hell? Uh, what else do we have on this star card? Please and thank you. Anything else? The Emperor. Yeah, y'all. <clears throat> My feminines out there, just, just play, pay very close attention to anyone you are currently sleeping with. And you know what? For some of you, supply your own fucking condom so a man can't go poking holes in the shit, okay? Now, this is just some real talk, guys. This is just some real talk. Because we've got two, uh, two male energies showing up. And I don't like how they show up around the feminine energy, okay? 
Mm. Oh, okay. We we putting that shit to rest. Okay. Y'all just be y'all just be thinking about that shit. And women, yeah, you know what? Buy your own fucking rubbers. Oh spirit, what the fuck? Gems? What the hell? Someone's got some shit going on, okay? So uh keep up on your birth control. Keep up on your uh uh, some of you feel the need to go see your gynecologist. See your gynecologist. Something might be up, okay? That, and, and that's all Daddy wants to say on that. that that's all we want to say on that. And g good luck with that, okay? We send you peace, love, and light, and uh, the best of luck on that, okay? Woo, spirit. A little Palo Santos for my Gemini Collective. Woo. Woo, spirit. Spirit, see my... Oh. Mm. God protects me and God fights my battles. No weapon formed in spirit or physical against me shall prosper. I'm highly favored and protected from all evil, as is my beautiful Gemini Collective. You beautiful bitches. Some of y'all might be going through some shit, okay? So let's just hope this is a cautionary tale and Daddy can give you the heads up before... Definitely watch any masculine energies in your life. Well, I... I seen the page of wands down there, guys, but I don't remember if I cut the deck or not. So we just gonna shuffle it one more time and cut this bitch. Okay. Some of y'all just be leery of the masculines around you, and anyone you start dating, maybe ask how many children that they got and how many different baby mamas they got, and that should be a red flag. Okay. The moon in reverse, the ten of swords in reverse, the seven of swords in reverse, and the four of swords in the upright. So y'all have been through some shit, okay? If this is dealing with that energy, guys, uh, Lord, please. Truths come out, right? You're not confused anymore. You know the situation. You know. You know what you need to know, Gemini's. The, the moon showing up prominently again in the reverse. I told you at the beginning, there's some confusion and clarity you need to get. But it's on your part. You're overthinking something. You're not letting something in that needs to fucking end, Gemini's. Okay? There, uh, you know what you need to know to make the decisions you need to make. Uh, it's pretty clear what you need to do. Uh, why you keep dicking around making that decision is beyond me. Because... This was all about the deceptive energy. Remember I said I didn't feel like it was deception? Maybe it's just your deception? Or someone trying to gaslight you, making you think it was your deception, when really they were being deceptive. Like I said, supply your own fucking rubber so no one can poke holes in the sons of bitches, okay? Y'all, we just, we just, this grown-up conversation here for a minute, Gemini, we're having a grown-up conversation, Okay. Whatever the fuck is going on, Gems, you just need to take 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 some time, okay? Take some time. We're going to put this read, I don't know if I said it, about the first two weeks of May, guys. Uh, some of y'all just need to heal. Like, seriously heal. You're healing from a broken heart. You've had your heart trampled on, right? You need to get the clarity and realize what the fuck's up. Some of you women, you might be recuperating, okay? So, um, Gems, this energy, this energy... You need to drop it. Drop the motherfucker, okay? Drop them. Drop them. Because we got the double eights right here. Eight of Pentacles in the upright and the Eight of Cups in reverse. Um, you're trying to work on a situation, but emotionally, it's just keeping you stuck. So no matter how fucking hard you work, you're not going to be able to run from the emotions. You're not going to be able to escape this, okay? Okay? Until you let a motherfucker go. Spirit, what the, what the, what the fucking hell, Gemini's? Y'all, we getting some serious shit going. Because, yeah, some of you might be... I get it, Jims. I get it. I see now. 
some of you all are being led to 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 happiness. You're you're being led to this Ten of Pentacles energy, right? But currently, it's probably not the one that you're thinking, Gems. Okay, because we got an unbalanced situation here. Now, Spirit ain't going to lead you into this Ten of Pentacles energy if they know it's unbalanced, right? So uh, you're holding off. I think what the issue is, you guys are holding off for the one that you think is it. But this person, you just got to drop them because they are not the fucking one. This person is not going to be able to bring you stability and happiness. This person's all about the fuckery. This person hurts you. This person is not taking responsibility. Okay? For some of you, this could be a co-worker. It's a very unbalanced situation. Whatever the hell you got your ass into, Geminis, it's very unbalanced. And it has a little twins in an uproar. But spirits like, bitch, you know what the fuck to do. You know what to do. Spirit is not going to send you into a situation that is unbalanced. That's not how God works. So the one you're thinking about, the one you're obsessing about, the one that is fucking with your energy and your emotions is not the one, okay? In due time, you will see this. Spirit is going to bring it to your attention. That's why, uh, and a lot of you definitely, y'all need to fucking heal. Whatever you've been through, whatever you're going through, some of my feminines especially, and that's all I'm going to say on that. Some of y'all are going to have to heal. You're going to have to take the time out, let your body heal, let your emotions kind of get leveled out. Some of you, if you need a script, go get a fucking script for a nerve pill. Whatever you need to do, because this is some major shit, okay? And you got some major decisions coming up. But spirit is going to let you see that maybe, y'all, it ain't even a fucking maybe. Whoever the fuck you were holding on to, you need to drop this motherfucker, Okay? That's the only way that victory comes in the end. That's the only way you're going to be able to come out of this a winner. Because Spirit wants to bring you good. Spirit's promising you a victory. Spirit is promising you options and movement towards a happy, steady relationship, partnership with somebody. But it's not the one you fucking think, Gems. You'll know if this is your reading, if the person you're dealing with has multiple baby mamas. You'll know this if this is your reading, if, you know, you might have uh, gotten pregnant by someone and then later found out they just had multiple uh, baby mamas. Or, you know, like I said, y'all, I can't stress it enough. Supply your own fucking rubbers, ladies. Men? Ah, okay. They said the same thing with men. Supply your own fucking rubbers, dude, because she could be putting holes in those things to get fucking money. Where is it at? I didn't want to go there. But it was at the bottom, guys. The Page of Pentacles. Someone that's just out for money. Someone that's just being deceptive. Trying to get. This is immature energy, right? Now, some of y'all, if you were dealing with someone from the past and you they happen to call you up and you go fuck them. One last little sympathy fuck. They might be trying to do that to get money off of you. Some of y'all, this could be a pregnancy type situation, right? Someone trying to trap somebody with a pregnancy. Male or female. Both sexes do that shit. And that's that's the lowest of the low, guys. Some of y'all, someone might have paid for an abortion. Oh, we gotta get out of this energy, guys. We have got to get out of this energy. Gems, I... Uh, my collective sends you the, the, the best with that, that healing of that situation. And may everything work out uh, good for you on that front. Ooh, spirit. Y'all Geminis. What the, what the mother loving hell. Thank God I ain't got to worry about that shit. Jesus. But there you go. That's someone's situation. Gems. Now that, however the hell you factor into that. You're either able to get pregnant or you're able to get somebody pregnant. You know what I mean? Whatever's going on in that situation is dealing with a, a pregnancy. You're dealing with someone who has multiple babies out there. Masculine or feminine. Guys, this could be split down the fucking middle. Okay? You're either popping them out or you're the one putting them in there. You know what I mean? 
So, uh, cautionary tale, and definitely with the rubbers with the damn holes in it, because some of y'all could have been thinking, oh, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm being said, Daddy John, I'm wearing a rubber, really? Bitch put a fucking a hole in it. Or dude put a fucking hole in it. Because someone's definitely out to get some fucking money. See, that, that turned into a fucking a money trap. That turned into a baby trap. So some of y'all dealing with some karma, right? Now, the two of cups there in reverse showing up, that could have been somebody who has a family on the side, right? And they, uh, uh, the, the other person, the third party person gets knocked up in a situation, or the third party person tries to get knocked up in a situation. Again, guys, that could be split 50 50, masculine or feminines, okay? That's just some fucked up energy, gems. Woo, sweet Jesus. And you need to, you need to, uh, get some clarity as to what the fuck is going down, okay? Male or female on this, guys. I wanted to say turtles could factor into this. Maybe somebody bought like a, 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 a turtle toy for a child, stuffed animal or something. There's turtle. I'm getting turtle absolutely from that. You all see where I get that? Turtles. Turtles going to factor into something. And y'all, I don't know what the hell the, the, the turtle animal, what that animal spirit means. But turtle definitely factors into this shit. Four of cups, ace of swords, the... Oh, uh, shit. Oh, gems, what did you all get your asses into? What did you all get your asses into? Some of y'all definitely regret the decision that you made. If you made an offer towards somebody or someone came towards you and you accepted somebody's cup, you are now regretting it. Let's hope this is a cautionary tale. Um, if someone comes in, you need to pay very close attention to this person. Because, y'all, I hate to say it, I'm really getting, like, abortion vibes from this like a fucking motherfucker, okay? Uh, a very narcissistic energy. Like I said before, this could be somebody who was married. Uh, masculine or feminine, guys, we're, this is this could go either side. Either side. Uh, someone, uh, someone trying to manipulate through, you know? If uh, uh, a married person knocked you up or you got knocked up by a married person... And you don't want people to realize there was a pregnancy involved. Yeah, someone might say, well, we need to get rid of the child. That's the solution instead of being proactive to begin with. That's why daddy is not liking this fucking energy. But, Jims, we got to go here because this is where the cards are fucking telling me, right? And maybe you're in your head trying to decide, uh, should you keep your baby or not? Papa, don't preach. I'm in trouble deep. I know you in trouble deep, girl, but daddy's going to talk to you real here. Or dude, daddy's going to talk to you real here. Okay? Now, um, this is a situation. What are you going to do? Now, daddy's pro-choice. You know what? That's the woman's decision, guys. I can't give birth, so I don't feel like I can comment on that. Uh, hate it or not. I think it's the woman's choice. And maybe some masculine energy is maybe trying to force that on somebody. Or maybe some feminine energy is just trying to wrangle somebody up for some money to get money for one. Whatever the hell's going on here, it's very fucking deceptive. Okay? And I don't like this energy because someone is fucking around with the child. And I'm wanting to say it's an unborn child. I don't think this child has been born yet. Because someone wasn't paying attention when they were out fucking around. Paying attention with their third party. Someone just was not paying attention. Because I think someone, this very well could just be a manipulative energy, right? 
Ladies, some guy just wanted to knock you up. Just to mark you. Men, some woman just wanted to, to get knocked up by you. This is not a good fucking energy. You're not in communication. You're not talking with this person. So whatever, Jim, that's probably why you need to polish your mirror. Whatever the hell you're going through, this person done went ghost. Now, masculine or feminine here, right? Whoever the hell is going through this has laid this problem out. Or women, you know, you're dealing with it currently. But there's no communication from the other party involved. They went ghost. They're nowhere to be fucking found. So someone is left with this decision to make on their own. Now, some of you, if this child has been born, the court system is going to work in your favor. The good old Lord up above the court system is going to work in your favor on this. Right? Um, oh my God, guys. If some of you might have been assaulted in a work type situation or some sort of instance like that, um, you will get vindicated. And when I say as above, so below. Or as above, so below. Yeah, it, it's it's happening, guys. And whatever toxicity and fuckery someone tried to do and manipulation they tried to use in this situation, for some of you, this could be someone in partnership or someone that you're not in partnership with. And, and I think whoever the hell you were fucking around with was with somebody, right? They wanted to keep this shit away from their partner. And uh, at the end of the day, I think someone's just trying to shake down somebody. Male or female here, guys, this could go either fucking way. And y'all know exactly what I mean. Right? I'm getting nine... Guys, it could be nine months in. This baby could be getting ready to be born. So, shit, yeah. You know, the child might... It's probably about time for this child to be born. And uh, when this child gets born, there's going to be a hell of a lot of conflict in a, a happy relationship. Or what someone thought was a happy relationship. Because every time we've seen this Two of Cups, guys, it's been in the reverse. So if people are putting on a nice front, that it's a, it's a nice, loving, happy home. It's not. But get ready for some conflict when this child is born. Because there's definitely going to be a child born. But this child was meant to be born. So if, the, if abortion was on the table at one point in time, it never happened. So this child is going to be born because spirit made sure. Spirit stepped in to save this child. And for some of you, this could happen within the next two weeks. This child will be born. This mother will have peace. She's not going to be worried about uh, the child. Because when I say spirit is stepping in on this, the will of fortune and the Hierophant. God has been watching this process. Y'all, thank God. So those of you worried, I don't think we had any abortions. The Six of Pentacles here in reverse. The Gemini's King of Swords here. You're really going to have to stand your ground and have your wits about you to make sure you aren't shorthanding this situation. It's come up before in my past readings to make sure that whoever baby daddy is, uh, DNA testing, all that shit to prove so they can't deny your child what is rightfully theirs. Access to everything. And if they are in a relationship, a marriage, a partnership, to let it be known. That there was a marriage conceived outside of this partnership. You get what is rightfully your child's. 
And you know what, guys? The happy... <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> some of y'all like me, you're getting this breath of fresh air because I'm thinking, Lord Spirit, what the hell we just read? The baby's going to be fine and healthy and beautiful, okay? <laughs> That's the happiness. That's the happiness. No matter what these grown-ass people were doing, and there is a lot of fuckery and manipulation in this, guys. Now, whosoever side it's on, you know it fits your story or not. But at the end of the day, y'all see that that healthy little chubby child? Well, she's not so chubby, but she happy as fuck. Look at that. With many birthdays to celebrate. Woo! Thank you, spirit. Uh, so, gems, that explains this. Y'all gonna have to see the truth. The truth, the whole truth, everything's gonna have to come out. Whatever anyone's trying to do to keep shit hidden and kind of keep this this mystery around it, you gotta you gotta wipe away all that shit, okay? Truth's gotta come out. You gotta have 2020 vision because at the end of the day, spirit's saying you look out for this baby. You make sure that nobody tries to deny this baby of anything that is rightfully theirs. And y'all can bet your sweet fucking ass. That whatever manipulation or fuckery was used to try to cover this up or prevent this or deny this, spirit up above and the court of law is going to step in here to make sure that this fucking beautiful baby gets taken care of. Mm. See, you got to flip that script, y'all, because I was like you. I was like, oh my God, what the hell, John? What are you reading, Daddy John? Papa don't preach, I'm in trouble deep. Papa don't preach, I've been losing sleep. But I made up my mind, I'm keeping my baby. Oh, I'm gonna keep my baby. And that would be exactly what daddy would tell you. Keep that damn child. Now, you grown-ups need to figure out your fucking mess. Because there's definitely some deception and fuckery around that. This wasn't a child conceived in love, which is why the good Lord up above is going to come down and protect this child. Because the adults in this situation are some motherfuckers. And they will get handled for the deception and bullshit that they tried to prove or do. Because that child is definitely divinely protected. Y'all grown-ups, on the other hand, when he comes in to bless this child, he's going to make sure karma gets sent out to the correct parties in the precise amount of distribution, okay? So if you were the, the one that was taken advantage of, you're going to be rewarded. If you were the one that was taken advantage of a person or a situation, yeah, you're going to be dealt with too. In the court of law and from the big guy up above. So... Whew, thank God, y'all, that we turn that shit around. We turn that shit around. God bless you, whoever's going through this. I know it's tough. Peace, love, and light, sweetie. You got this. You got this.